Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be filming a haul. Um, please excuse my appearance and my voice. I am terribly sick and I know I have not posted a video in two weeks and that is because I've had midterms and this. <laughs> I'm really sick and the lighting is so bad because we're expecting snow. Like all the schools got out early today and yesterday was actually a snow day so yeah, I really apologize for all of that. I just really need to sit down and film a video because I've been like pushing it back because I was like, no, like I literally can't get up. I'm so sick. And then, um, yeah, I decided that I really just needed to film something. So this haul isn't going to be huge, but some stuff that I picked up recently. And there's like a couple things I just had never showed you, but I had gotten probably in the last month, I guess. So first, I'm going to start off with clothes. It's only three things. I went to Nordstrom Rack, I think. Uh, a week and a half, like a week and a half ago, and I saw the sweater and I really liked it. Um, <clears throat> it's a little bit different than anything I had, and it originally was forty two dollars, and then it was eighteen ninety seven, so it was really good. And it's by the brand Alodi, and I got it in a medium because that's a little bigger for me. Anyway, so the reason I really liked it was it's cream, but it has like a gray knit crochet type of cross across it. And I can wear this this with leggings, and I don't know, I so saw it was really cute. I'm going to wear like a cream bandeau under it. But, um, yeah, I really liked it because I love sweaters, and you guys know that. So this year I've been wearing a lot of, like, yoga leggings and everything just because, um, I'm a junior in high school, so obviously it's very stressful, but my stress is kind of, like, gone now because, um, I mean, midterms out of the way, and then I don't have a seventh block anymore because... It was a one semester online class, so now I have like early dismissal and dance team is almost over, so I feel like I just have a lot more like free time and I just a lot less stressed now, so it's really nice. So, um, anyway, to the point of this, I got into a pair of yoga pants. I just want to do a whole other story. But, um, if you guys watch my videos, you see that I wear the ones, they're from Pagan, they have like the, just like diamonds all over them, like at the top on the fold over, and honestly, I need to retire them because like, they are so faded, it's not even funny. Like, they almost look like dark gray. And they're getting really thin, it's like, bad. So, I really wanted a pair of just all black ones, I like the fold over to be plain. And I knew that Forever 21 had some. If you guys are where I live, like, you follow me on Twitter, or like, Instagram. This one mall near me, that's closer to me, and it's like, it has this huge, like, two level Forever 21. And I love their clothes, like, their nice clothes section, but the, like, their athletic section there, just like sucks like it's really bad like there's like nothing there and then there's this other mall that's a little bit further but it's a really nice mall but then like the um fur 21 in there is like a pigsty but their athletic section is like really good so I don't know but I found at the other mall the one with the bad forever 21 they had a pair so if you know what I'm talking about I would check out that mall if you guys could understand what I was saying um but I wear them today so that's why they're kind of like you can tell they're worn but literally they are so soft and like honestly let's be real here the pink like like yoga pants are not very good quality I think we could say that truthfully and they're extremely overpriced for what they are um now yes granted I have gotten my good use out of this but like last year they're already started to be like a little bit of a hole in the seam and like they started to fade really quickly and already when you get them they're not like a complete black color they're kind of like an off black color like a really light one so I don't know, but these are literally so soft. And, like, the band is really thick. And, um, like, it, they kind of come up high, but, like, you fold over, obviously. But, like, they're kind of are up, up high. But I don't really mind that. Like, I think that's kind of comfortable. They're only twelve eighty, so they're a yoga legging. So I was, like, so happy about that because I, um, like to wear them with Uggs. So, yeah, I got those. And then also, um, if you guys watch my outfit of the weeks, also you know that I don't wear jeans. Like, I literally just hate them. I find them so uncomfortable. Like, I don't hate the way they look. I just find them so uncomfortable. And the thought of having to put on jeans is literally, like, pretty much the same as, like, taking, like, a steak knife and, like, stabbing it in my eyeball. Like, you guys just don't understand how much I hate pants. Like, ooh, bad. So, I really wanted a pair of black pants, like, tight, no pockets that I could wear with like shirts like that I don't have to wear a sweater every single day so I found these from Target actually and they were well, I don't have the tag anymore obviously but they were um, $19.99 which I found really cheap and they're pretty much like the pixie pant but without the zipper in the back 
So they have like lines in them, like pants. Like I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see. Like they have like the lines, and like there's a line in the back, and they're just high waisted, and like they kind of come up like mid belly button, and there's like a thick elastic at the top. So I really like them, and they're like skinny at the bottom. Like yeah, um, I really like them. I am very happy that I got them because now I can wear them with like shirts instead of having to wear a sweater all the time. So now I'm going to go into some of the accessories I got. Okay, so for this first thing is something that I really was searching for a really good one for a really long time and it is like the bubble necklace and if you watched my most recent outfit of the week you saw me wearing this one and it is the cream one with the kind of grayish little beads and it is not real. Um, I actually got it off of Amazon and just type in like J. Crew bubble necklace a bunch of like fake ones will come up and um, this one was actually from China and I think it was like $13.99 or something like that but um, it's a lot less expensive than the real one so um, yeah I really like it the reason I could that you could see is fake is because it, like the beats aren't rounded but um, yeah I really like it and I think I got this color just because it's like a basic color I could wear with so many things but also from Charlotte Russe because um, I know they're selling these too. I got like a peachy pink color because I like this color and yeah, I thought it was nice. And this I think was only $12.99 at Charlotte Russe. But yes, yeah, so I got this one too and I really liked it. I got this one a little bit while back but I just never showed it because I haven't been hauling all of my stuff. But if you guys would like me to start doing that again, I will. So the other day at Forever 21 when I got the yoga pants, I seen this necklace online. I really liked it. So I decided to go ahead and pick it up when I saw it. And um, it looks like this. It's like rose gold. Kind of more bronzy than rose gold, but I really like it. Um, and it's just like a collar necklace, kind of. I mean, it's like short, like one. But it has like little studded pyramids. And I really like it a lot. So I think it'll be really cute. Obviously not with my sweatshirt, but it'll be really cute when I have like a cuter shirt on than my hoodie. And then also when I was at the mall, there was this um, kiosk stand of belly button ring. Anyway, me and my mom really like the Hamsa sign, like hand thing, a lot. And it's not like for any religious reason, like I'm Catholic, but um, we just like really like it. And that's probably not being very, very good Catholic of me, but I don't know. I really like everything. It's really cool. Like I have a bunch of necklaces with it and everything. So when I saw this, I was like, holy crap, like that's so cool. Um, it was $25, which is a little pricey for a belly button ring, but it's so pretty and so unique. And it's actually handmade, they said. So it looks like this, and it is a little Hamsa hand with a pink jewel in it. They had it in gold. Um, I'm not really a gold belly button person. I don't know. Um, and they had it with like a bunch of different colored bees in the center. But I know I really liked it with the pinks. It's different than just like the all diamond ones because I have a lot of those. So like you can't really see the difference all the time. Actually, things I never hauled. I got them like a while ago, probably like three weeks ago. They are the little um, hair bands that like don't leave creases in your hair and. Um, if you guys, I mentioned this before, my mom's a hairstylist, so there's like these little like hair places where like she buys all her stuff, like scissors and all that stuff. So um, we get really good discounts on stuff when we go there. So um, I found these and they were like maybe a dollar each, I think. So um, I got one in a hot pink color and I like this color with my hair. It's like a rosy blush type of color and I like them. They're really soft. And then um, I also got a like wall decal thing. It says wall designer accents. Um, I got from Target, I think it was like $15, right? Yeah, um, pretty much this is what it looks like. I guess you see it. It's like the chandelier, um, because I have like a little crystal chandelier over top of my bed. So yeah, I thought it was really cool, and it has like jewels so you can like stick on it. I think to resemble like shininess, I guess. And it's like two parts, too. Well, no, it's actually a bunch of different parts. That's how you put it together. So yeah, I need to have my dad help me do this because he's like really tall, so... He could do that. Um, if you guys know, I have this new recent obsession with candles. So, um, I got this one from Yankee, these three from Yankee Candles. This first one is the pumpkin pie. They were having a lot of good sales on, like, their fall, winter ones. They're bringing out the spring ones. And I've used this one. It's very potent, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I had this burning, and my door was closed, and my dad opened it, and he was like, jeez. Um, I think it smells really good. It's definitely more of a fall one. It's not something I could really light all the time, so I feel like I would kind of get sick of it. But if you want to, I doesn't say how much it is, so just kidding. I don't know. Um, I got two of the little ones. I got peppermint bark and gingerbread. 
I can't really smell them too well. Um, I don't really know how I feel about peppermint bark. So, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Sorry again for the appearance and the lighting because I think, yeah, it's snowing. My Instagram and my Twitter will be linked down below, um, so you can go ahead and follow me. And what else? Um, yeah, so um, be expecting a video next week of outfits, and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you. Bye.